Hi, I am Victor Bologan and I want to present you a new DVD on Reti. Uh, Richard Reti was a very interesting original player and uh, he brought us a very complex, very interesting opening starting with first move knight f3. Later his uh, preference was to play c followed by c4 and uh, the, the whole idea of uh, the deep idea of Reti was to postpone uh, the fight for the center for the middle game stage uh, and uh, this subtle preparation for this uh, latest d4 usually confuses less experienced opponents and uh, when already the d4 comes in the picture it's already too late for black to rearrange his pieces this is more or less the whole concept for Reti. in this dvd uh, i want to uh, uh, introduce you the some modern ideas, some improved ideas of Reti, because Reti is played for many years. It was played since times of Capablanca, times of Smyslov, and even times of Kramnik now. So, I mean, many different generations have different approaches, and of course now in the computers area, it's uh, it's difficult to prove an advantage in such opening as Reti. That's why I was uh, trying to find the best move orders, uh, the best ideas, modern ideas, and to improve, uh, to find advantage for white. Uh, at some uh, lines in the beginning I had difficulties to do so, so finally I managed to some, find some ideas, playable ideas for white. But of course it's very complex. First of all, talking about Reti, we talk about uh, the solution against different uh, openings against D4 for white. For example, uh, they can, uh, some players like to play Grunfield, some playing Kings Indian, some playing players like to play Dutch. And uh, Reti, it's a very good uh, uh, solution against those players because we simply take them usually out of their theory, out of their deep, uh, good preparation, and we simply ask them to play chess. Reti is about playing chess, and that's why it's so popular nowadays, and all these top players who are bored about their own analysis, like tons of analysis, they all come here to Reti especially Vladimir Kramnik, where his, uh, he can show his uh, art of chess, his uh, strengths of chess, his techniques, very high techniques. So, uh, Knight of 3 is really a very interesting move and it's just about playing games uh, of chess. I would say that uh, in uh, this DVD, uh, the solution against uh, Grunfeld, it's a very important uh, question. It's uh, that we don't allow this Grunfeld, and, and uh, we have two ideas for uh, white. One is to play with knight f3, c4, and b4, and the other is to play with anti Grunfeld setup, and not to put the pawn on d4, but to play knight c3, cd5, knight d5, and queen b3. Against the uh, King's Indian, uh, it's uh, still always possible to go for King's Indian, but I if we want to avoid it, we again we can play for, uh, we go for uh, B4, opt for B4 option. Uh, against the uh, Slav defense, uh, this is a very important, uh, very solid opening. In this case, I would uh, recommend you to uh, have this in mind, this uh, fast jump on E5 in case of bishop g4 or if he puts bishop f5 then immediately to attack his uh, queen side by taking first on d5 and then queen b3 if he takes e d5 then d3 and e4 if he takes cd5 then queen b3 is very strong uh, against the classical setup when he just like in queen's gamut declined he puts just knight f6 e6 d5 c5 again we have i give here two options for you uh, one is uh, that uh, we take on d5 cd5 ed5 and then play for d4 we have double fianchetto and classical isolated pawn and the second one is uh, when we just keep the bishop on b2 we play e3 and this long plan what is improvement here on my understanding is that in this structure with dc4 bc4 we don't go d4 as i did in this uh, this summer but uh, we will go, we will remove our knight from f3 to e1, we will play f4, g4, and in the structure we will kind of uh, again uh, uh, postpone our d4 for a very later stage. Uh, talking about uh, Black's Fianchetto to b7, we, we do discuss some Hedgehog type of positions. 
In this case, uh, I think this plan with queen d4, rook d1, queen f4 is quite good. Good hedgehog for white. Uh, another very important moment which uh, I was reflecting myself in my DVD on the c4, c5, because of course, talking about rate, we talk about English opening as well, because many just simple direct transpositions, like in the case of knight f3, c5, c4, we have clear transposition to the English opening. And uh, here uh, the improvement is that lately uh, White find an advantage in the critical position, which I also examined in this DVD. Just in case for your general knowledge, in the four knights setup, I do examine the main plan after g3, d5, cd, knight d5, and bishop g2 with all three possible moves for black. So uh, we can see that uh, this knight f3, this DVD knight f3, it's practically a whole repertoire for white, and on anything, anything uh, black can reply against first knight f3, and it's exactly, it's something like you just, uh, if you just, you can play only this with white uh, and uh, forget about any other e4, d4, c4, if you don't have time or if you I don't know, tired of big theory, this is quite very comfortable move to play. Of course, uh, as I mentioned, this was played by all the classical players, and uh, even Kasparov tried this in his match, World Championship match against Kramnik. Uh, so, Knight of Three is serious. Okay, there was. It's a serious uh, uh, opening and very deep uh, prepared. And I think uh, the ideas, the advices which I can give you is that uh, you also can always check the new games on on this opening of top players' games. Uh, but uh, the basic, the skeleton of uh, this opening you can find in this DVD and some general idea, practical ideas. And uh, I think uh, this Reti can bring you a lot of points. So I wish you good luck with the improved Reti. And see you on the, our next DVD.